welcome back to my channel so I just finished filming this look for you guys I don't know there's nothing like a red lip that makes me just feel like yes get them girl today is your day <laughs> I will try to link all the products that I use below uh, I'm trying to figure that out because I I don't want the links to be super long and that's the only way right now that I'm able to get the links and they're just copy and paste and that just looks too cluttered and remember I am not a makeup artist this is just what I do how I like colors on my face to look I don't want to slap some paint on the barn yeah it's for paint so I hope you guys like it stay tuned see you in my next one all right guys so first we're starting off with a fresh face I just washed my face it's nice and clean time to dance and then the first thing we're going in is with my Lush Aroma Water. It's just a toner water. This is the Rose and Lavender one. I just like to press that into my skin and I love the way it feels underneath my moisturizer when I'm going to do my makeup. To moisturize, I'm using my Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. It's one of my favorites. I love the way it makes my skin feel and look. I just love it. It's great. Good things. I'm just rubbing that all over. Mm -hmm. Nice and moisturized. Then I'm gonna go on with my Kiehl's Micro Blur Skin Perfector. This just helps really fill in my fine lines. I have tons of laugh lines around my mouth. They're great, I love them, but they make makeup such a chore because you can see them. So I'm just patting them in. Ugh, nails. Yeah, those are bad. As you can see, I took that polish off. I'm going in with my MAC Studio Fix Fluid Foundation in NC50. This matches my skin perfectly. I love the way it blends in. I, I usually go with a light hand, so not too much coverage, but you can build it up. Just rubbing that all over my face and making sure I blend it in. Just moisturizing my dry lips with some Burt's Bees. Next, I'm gonna go in with my Toffee, which is the LA Girl Pro Conceal color I'm using for my under eye area. I typically use Fawn, but I wanted to go for something just a little lighter to really brighten up my under eye. They were looking a little dark today. There I am putting it down the bridge of my nose, giving my Real Techniques sponge a spritz and blending that all out. <music> concealer is nice and blended I'm gonna grab the dark cocoa LA girl pro conceal and just try to chisel out a little bit of face I also like using this to warm my face up a bit I don't know I really like this color so I'm just blending that in I'm gonna make sure you blend 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 then I'm gonna go in with a little bit of the concealer on my eyelids just as a nice neutral base also to hopefully prevent some of that crease in that's gonna happen so getting my eyebrows and I'm just using the elf kit in medium so for eyeshadow I'm taking max saddle and I'm gonna put that all in my crease I'm going for a pretty neutral eye today so saddle is the perfect thing or perfect color in my opinion for that transition color in the crease and I'm just blending that all in from my makeup palette or my naked two makeup palette I'm grabbing foxy and I'm basically just putting that all over the lower section of my lid. That's the really, really light color on the end. Just giving us a little bit of a gradient here. A little reverse ombre action on my lids. Absolutely love using this MAC blush on my eyes. It is the Film Noir Matte Blush. It's a deep burgundy color and I just love deepening my um, eyeshadow looks with it it's just so pretty so delicious and it's a great blush color too so 
I really love the way it looks on my skin. The key with this is blending it all out. So now that I've had that in there, I'm gonna go in and just blend, blend, blend. absolutely hate eyeliner I am the worst at it not only do they never look like sisters they're more of the distant cousins twice removed variety they never match but I had to do a little bit of a liner today because I wanted to attempt putting on some falsies which I suck at as well but I'm trying to get better and guess what you don't get better unless you do it right so I'm just lining my eyes, very thin line, um, just something so you don't see the band of the falsies. So I'm just getting that on and then hitting the next side with the liner. I actually don't know or don't remember which liner this is. It might be L'Oreal, but the writing's pretty much off of it and I cannot tell. But use any black liner that you love. Um, I just, this is right now the darkest black liner that I have, so it's gotta work for us. Now because I absolutely suck at putting on lashes, I am going to attempt these off camera <laughs> and let me tell y'all, it took me about 35 minutes to get these on and they still looked a hot mess at the end. Towards the end, I just kind of go back over my liner and just try to darken up the spaces where you can kind of see the band. Um, a little bit, a little bit of it is glue and that's still drying and it does dry semi clear but that duo glue is not my favorite. Next, I'm going back in with my Film Noir blush by MAC and I'm just, you know, giving us a little bit of cheek action. Hey, yes, a little blush. <laughs> Here I'm just going in with my Sephora blue eyeliner. I love doing a pop of eyeliner on the bottom lash line. I just think it's so cute and I try to stay away from black eyeliners just because they never stay on really well and they end up running down my face and I just, they create like a ring. I just don't like it. So blue is cool. I like the blue line. Here I am just cleaning up my brows a bit. This is the LA Girl Pro Conceal and this is actually in Fawn. Fawn is pretty much my favorite color for my skin, but I'm just cleaning them up a bit, then I'll blend it out and we'll move on to lips. So this is the ColourPop Lippy Stick in Trust Me and I'm gonna follow that up with the liquid lipstick in Creeper. I like the way these two look together. Y'all see that little one lash on the um, left side or right about to come down? Mm, struggle. Y'all see why I don't wear lashes? Mind you, that's the glue still trying to dry too. I can't. I tried. There we go. All right, I'm going in with my highlighter, which is actually a bronzer by The Body Shop. I'm going to just brush a little bit over my Cupid's bow down my nose. And that is it. <music> 